All right, what's up guys and welcome to, well, me getting myself coming champion. Uh, hello the team and uh, I switched, I think I learned a few moves, no? No, just recover, I'm just confirm, what, what do I do? Like I recover is it? and I bring in Mesha first. Basically I was considering whether or not she bring God of War or not uh, to lead off with. I know she started with Spirit Tomb, like that's an infamous thing, but I think that my best series of plan is uh, knocking off whatever item because they carry items every time and um, take it from there. Like I think I lose Machamp versus this, which would be problematic. <sighs> Not a big fan of Spirit Tomb. Be great seeing it though. Um, I think this is the only way for you finding it because I think you can find it post game afterwards. Could be wrong about that. But yeah, is it not? I hope it's physical. I hope it, like have sucker punch stuff like that. See, Nagaf will do very poor damage. Oof, that's psychic. Ah, yeah. Ooh, ooh, yo, oh, wait, wait. We took it. We took it somehow, but we're still die though. Nagaf again. Uh, any damage is good damage here. My anything that ensures a guard work can kill. This thing is gonna be all I needed because I think I think my best plan of going about this is making sure that Gardevoir and Empoleon are somewhat healthy to come in well versus other matchups I hope I really hope it's like Dazzling Gleam please kill <laughs> please I need it thank god right 5 of 5 uh, like my Stratford's guard shop is basically make sure the star after is living. <laughs> That's my only strat. Let's see. What can she bring in now? Oh yeah, and I gave her leftovers to God of War instead of um, my Empoleon. Roserade. <sighs> Sludge Bomb. I think Jeltis can take that one, right? I hope. Energy is probably going to be very problematic to stomach bed. Let's see, yeah. Immune, bitch. Ice Beam or Real Pack? Ice Beam is probably stronger. Energy Ball will do. Ooh. Bit on too much, side. Bit on too much. Ice Beam. Freeze. Could not rely on quick clock, can I? No. Send a Gengar. Or should I send Toga? No, it's not like quick attack is gonna kill it. Because I think Energy will probably do the same amount of damage actually to Gengar, even if the resistance is gonna like ruin it. Um, but I can at least recover. Oh my god, wow, yeah, it does like. Crazy damage. Mm, yeah, hyper potion it is. Hope quick claw and kick in so I don't have to like waste my recovery. Shadow ball, wow. Full on technician. Or not technician, just special. Oh, cursed body, nice. Or not really. I mean it doesn't help. <laughs> Would be better if we go for energy ball and get that curse bodied. No matter. Come on, quick law. Right? No, because why why use it if it's never gonna kick in anyway? Okay, okay, we got this. We're still in this. I know versus Gastrodon that I can stay in versus it. I know it doesn't have earth power. Here we go, nice. So it gives me some breeding room. Let's see. We got Lucario left. Got this guy left. Do I need to wake up anything? Probably wake up guys. Oh, it has earthquake. 
Well, that's worse. <laughs> Deny. Oh, crit. Nice. It's full on mixed. Huh, did not expect that. I, was, I heard it didn't have earth power, that was all I knew. Alright, Psychic. How much will Earthquake do to me? That's the question. Psychic does a lot at least. Rock Tomb. Not as scary, but still does a lot. Hmm. Question is, do I want to risk it? I want to save my max revive. Till the very end, if possible. Hope she keeps going for. No, grabs over an earthquake. Nice, it's gonna absolutely kill. Alright. Alright, alright, we got this. We got this, focus. Because I can go for a knockout with guys, shutting off his recovery. And hopefully Skull doesn't do too much, right? No leftovers. Rock Tomb is not gonna do anything either. Gonna go for a low sweep at least. Get some damage in there. Yeah, did way better. Here comes the Earthquake. I'm not sure that's healing either. Of course it does. Why wouldn't it? <laughs> Alright, Jiltis. Let's go. Grass nodding here. Quick claw. About time. Couldn't be like worse timing though, but yeah, how about that? <laughs> Okay. Okay, come on. So what happens now? Lucario happens now. That's uh, that's a GG in my book. Um, surfing or a swear? Oh shit! Yeah. So it's special. That's kind of that's kind of bad. The Zaxxus. I think we bulldoze. And try to salvage whatever goes on it. Oh, nice blood. Good. Good, 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 good. I think we guarantee... I, I think this is good. I think this could work. Full restore. Please. That's not gonna save you. But you're welcome to try. I <laughs> did way better now. The only thing I kind of think is tough is when it comes to recovery berries. Uh, oh, keep recovering. Um, I was kind of considering whether or not I can have some like sugar berry and stuff like that. Uh, but it looks like I don't even have them. I was kind of thinking, no, at least in Cynthia, because of that guard chop, but. So far, I'm not sure we'll even make it to Garchomp because what? We have Garchomp left and this Lucari will be knocked out, of course. We got one more Mon that I think is going to be just as scary. Is it a Magnuson? I hope it is. It depends on what comes out now. Yes, Toga. Oh, it's a Milotic. That's, uh... Oh. Okay. It's gonna ice beam me, for sure. I think I wake up Jeltis. And absolutely lose Garchomp. <laughs> I knew it. Oh my god. 
five. What could I even do there? Shit. Oh. It's Marvel scale. That's that's not great. So I can't beat it physically then. Um Alright, wake up, Elissa. <sighs> sea scald, yeah. Don't get me burned. <laughs> Please. So wait, we have scald. And what ice beam? Like, it has such a shallow move pool. I'm like really, really thinking here. What? What could I possibly put on it? Recover? Would I do that? It would be a never-ending game if I decided to do that. God, I hope not. Okay, how much recovery do I even got? I have one full restore. And I have one potion. And I have three max potion. Alright, <laughs> Maximizing everything here. Um, keep scalding. I am definitely thinking full restore here. It would be nice getting like a free switch in two. Let's see. Max potion on Elissa. Let's see. I think we survived the burn. Then we switch out with a full restore, right? Please tell me I survive. <laughs> Barely, but I did. And that's what's important. Nice. Alright, it's cold. Don't get me burned again. Nice. Okay, so now I hope this is a good switch in. Callbind and leftover should be able to at least disrupt something here. Um, let's see, skulls again. How much will it do? Wow, it does a lot actually. I hope Callbind kind of keeps me from getting absolutely ruined. Had a low HP too, so like I am convinced. I am convinced this has like something to like Skull and Ice Cream just is so shallow. I just feel life and we can't think of anything else but just now it's such a low HP, I should be able to attack it. Ooh, burn is not that's not great. Or you know. Clearly, leftovers saves me from the worst, but still. Alright. Um. Shockwave. Should be arranged, right? Please tell me this. Nope, it wasn't. But I live, right? No? Yes? Left towards first. Yes! <laughs> what comes first? <laughs> so burn does kill me. We're in this. So only the guard jump. Only the guard jump. Shockwave in, and it's so dead. More full resource. No, please, come on. No way. That's not fair. That's not fair at all. Oh, crit? Or was that... Had to be a crit. Yeah, like, way. Okay, maybe I should recover two then. That was not okay. Let's see. I have one more max potion. Ah, oh, it's just not great. But it's all I got. Don't get a crit on me, basically. Probably need to call my at least once more, I think. 
skulls. I mean, if you just keep scalding, I think it's fine. I'm just so worried about surprise mirror code, stuff like that. It's so tempting to just... Yeah, I need to do it. I basically give another crit, stuff like that, right? Oh, it's so close! Oh, it keeps attacking. Okay, I, I have no idea what this set is all about. But, um, I'll take it. Yeah, it was already burned. Like, oh yeah, it just surprised recover for no reason and then it got burned again. <laughs> what a perfect system. Okay, so I've no more full restores, right? I don't need it. Thanks. <laughs> okay. Let's think about this. The Zaxxus Gainer level, that's perfect. So right, I am kind of worried about this. Because in my book there are two routes I can take. Because here comes the chomp. And uh, wow, what a cool effect on this Pokeball. Um, basically, sack play Toga. I think that's what I gotta do. And uh, try to pull off a Bulldoze with my Guard Chomp to, to lower the speed. If I can do that, I think I'm good. Poison Jab. Ah, fuck, that's gonna hurt. Not as much as you would think. Okay. I end ever here, right? Oh no. What? No. That's not what I wanted to see. Ooh, cool. Rough skin? Pfft, please. <laughs> yeah, I barely attacked you. <laughs> okay, um. Side play, I, I need him to be neutral, right? That that's that's the play. Oh, please have outrage! Oh, dragonfly, that works. That works. That's not what I wanted, but it works. I'm just gonna poison jab again. Now I have a neutral sword stance. That is fucked up. This time it's probably killing too. Oh no! Got it! No! 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 You're kidding! You're kidding! You're kidding! No! Fuck! That's awful. Like I said, I need him to be at minus one. Um, Toga, come on, buddy. Poison jab. Oh, missed the move. Cool. Probably would have used that in something else, but fine, really. Toga, right, coming in. This time, however, that poison jab is gonna go for. He can get the poison now and take me out. I am fine with that. And now at least it's minus one, right? Poison jab. And ever for sure. If he sword stances, they're, yeah, straight up killing. Absolute killer. Now he has a minus one. Gotta take this advantage. Oh wait, no! Oh, Toga! Toga! Wow! Huh. Huh. But she could still have full restores. Toga still did great though. Bulldoze, this for sure. 
Yeah, like I was expecting that. Damn you, Cynthia. At least Bulldoze was the right play, for sure. Um, you should be slower than me now. I hope. I'm outraging. Yes. Yes, I'm a fucking champion somehow. Fuck. <laughs> oh. This was a tough, tough battle. Huh. Toga definitely saw this one. I just needed to lower the speed. That was all I needed to try and wrap this up. Um, hey, cool. I'm a champion. How about that? Yeah, this was, was hard. I'll be honest. Um, looking back at this, um, I think not going for last remaining trainers didn't make this for a quite a good challenge. And I still have probably pretty decent mods here, but definitely lower levels. But it looks like that wasn't such a big deal. And I am quite satisfied with this team. Um, probably glad I didn't bring Noctowl because Star Raptor was absolutely the star of this. Um, and Polion, of course, hanging on. God of War, just a massive, massive mon in that second or the fourth um, gym shenanigans. So I'm just glad this wasn't a Nuzlog. That would never have worked. If you ever Nuzlog this, I'm going to absolutely make sure I am on the right amount of levels because this this was way tougher than I wanted it to be but uh, it also makes the game for me at least definitely that much more fun because yeah I enjoy this this was fun it was a tough game and it it was a long game and I liked it exactly how I wanted probably every challenge from this game to be but that said I think it's time for you know uploading Wi-Fi Bells again, for sure. Still got a few months ready, I got help from some other players and I should be on the golden spot to actually just start uploading again. But yeah, looking at this team, there were definitely mods that were working and some mods weren't. I feel Machamp and Gengar was absolutely worthless. <laughs> but Empoleon, Garchomp, Star, Rapta, and um, Empoleon, Garchomp, Staraptor, and God of War was absolutely champs here for sure. But with that's it guys, always thanks for watching. I really mean that. And I'll see you guys in the next video. Until then, take care, alright? Bye.